Is it hard to share your faith? Jesus says, you never know what the impact of your faith story is going to be on someone who hears it. They might just get to meet me because of it. They might just get to know me better because of what you share. Philippians chapter 1 verse 14 says, we have been made confident in the Lord. So be confident. Dare to speak his word. Nothing's blocking your road, is it? No, not at all. So go right ahead and move ahead with courage. This past week, the two youngest members of my family <clears throat> stayed at my house along with their mom. And sometimes when I played with the two of them together, the difference in their personality was really quite evident. I was outside one day watering some seeded areas of my lawn. That's a lot of work. I mean, you really have to stay after that. But I, I was out there watering. And both of these boys, we're talking about a four-year-old and an eight-year-old, came out to play with me with their squirt guns. Well, <clears throat> I saw them at a distance and turned toward them with my hose aimed right in their direction. And I said, okay, I'm ready for you. One of them stood his ground and just looked at me and waited to see what was gonna happen next. The other one, he just grabbed a hold tightly of his squirt gun and came right after me. He didn't hesitate one second. Jesus says, be like that when it comes to telling people about me. Don't hesitate. Be confident. Nothing is blocking your road. No, not a single thing. Ask yourself what my 11th grade Sunday school teacher used to like to tell every single one of us in her class. Mrs. Yeager would smile at us and say, think about it, kids. I'm going to bring you out now to a shopping center close to the church and give you a chance to tell people about Jesus. Tell them about your faith. I want you to think because there are people out there who, if they don't hear about them, about Jesus from you now, they might not ever get to meet him might not ever get to know him well. So really be bold, be confident, go ahead, say it, come right after it like the little guy with the squirt gun. That's what grace to go really is all about.